ABC General Hospital spoilers reveal that Carly and Sonny broke up in an unhappy situation, so Carly really didn't want anything to do with Sonny anymore. It seems that recently Carly has been constantly having bad luck both at work and in love. Carly divorced Sonny after witnessing him in bed with Nina. The troubles that followed also continued to make Carly and Sonny's relationship become increasingly tense. Recently, Carly has been involved in investing in Aurora shares with the aim of making a huge amount of money. However, the merger of Aurora and ELQ did not happen as Carly had planned. That's why Carly lost all the money she poured in. That was the money she mortgaged Metro Court with. Perhaps in a situation like this, there is only Sonny who can save Carly. But Carly didn't want Sonny to see her pathetic appearance. She wouldn't expect Sonny to find out that she was empty-handed after the legal business and didn't even have enough money to get her hotel back. Laura's anxiety was completely justified. Anna and Valentine, these two are in love with each other. In fact, Valentine has been in love with Anna for a long time, and Anna, because she often works on the same mission with Valentine recently, also develops feelings. However, Laura feels that this relationship should not develop any further because Valentine is now Victor's son. You know, Victor is a villainous boss, and he is defiantly plotting something to endanger the inhabitants of Port Charles. Valentine is Victor's son. How could he not be involved in his schemes? Meanwhile, Anna is working with Laura and often capable people to fight Victor. If Anna and Valentine were officially in love, things would be very complicated. We do not know yet whether Valentine will follow Victor's orders or not. Will Valentine choose to be a bad person or a good person? Will he want to please his father and hurt Anna? Liz also just went through the darkest time of her life. Liz also did not expect Franco's death to, co to create psychological trauma, and since then, she began to behave strangely. The troublesome stories that Liz constantly encounters makes it impossible for her to have a full night's sleep. At first, Liz assumed that Franco's ghost had returned and caused trouble. However, it was she that had no problem. To ensure the safety of her family, Liz went to Shady Brook to receive treatment, and she did not want anyone to come and disturb her. However, spoilers said Kevin will go to Shady Brook and talk to Liz. I don't know what happened, but Liz's attitude was extremely tense. Was it because her mood wasn't stable? Did Kevin mention something that made Liz so agitated? Shouldn't he avoid making Liz agitated for the time being? Trina may find herself in a dilemma where she has to choose between her freedom and leaking information about Spencer. Trina's trial will take place and make, and maybe that's when Spencer will make his plan public. Contrary to Trina's thoughts, Spencer did not abandon her and went to Esme. Spencer actually realized Esme's evil nature and he only pretended to deceive Esme to find evidence to prove Trina's innocence. It seems that Spencer promptly brought evidence to expose Esme's crimes to the trial before Trina was convicted. This means that Trina was, will be proven innocent and at the same time Spencer will go public with what he has done. Although Trina will be in charge, will be cleared of the charge, it, also, it involves Spencer so she's not happy at all. Laura, Portia, and Jocelyn are the ones who are always by Trina's side and want her to provide an alibi. However, Trina is still hesitant to make it public. She's worried about Spencer, so how will things turn out in the end?